Did you recently win a deal? And when you deal, when you close the deal, did you high five someone? Did you celebrate? Were you excited? And of course you should. Great job, well done. How can we turn that great experience into an even better experience? Now here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna create, we're gonna create a short list of questions. And when we ask these questions, when somebody wins the deal, we walk over, we give the person a high five, you pop out your phone, you switch to video mode, and you start recording. You record these questions, you record the answer to these questions. And when you record these, these questions, you ask them. May I ask, was this an inbound or was this an outbound? When the customer came to it, what was the person's first and last name and can you spell it correctly? I'm gonna come back to that one. Then we're gonna ask, what was the impact that they wanted? By which date did they want it by? What was the critical event that was driving the decisions? You're asking a series of questions that will help you learn from this deal because that gong, that dinging the bell was not just to celebrate. It was essentially a call to go in learning mode. After we recorded that call, we upload that call onto a drive that can be Slack and we share it with everyone. The first one who really, really loves to hear this is most likely the customer success organization who during the onboarding briefly listens to this recording. And the recording lasts in general two to three minutes. But then we do something magic. What we do is remember that new employee when they come, we give them that beautiful headset, that oh, welcome to the company kind of headset. And they thought that was, oh my gosh, such a cool company. I got this cool new headset and so on, Bluetooth. Oh, it's amazing. And then what we let them, what we do is we put them on a desk and in the desk, we let them listen to this recording. We give them a little questionnaire. And in the questionnaire we ask, remember that person, what was the person that this deal closed? What was his or her name? Go to LinkedIn, look up that person. Here's five questions I want you to find out about, about that person. In her recommendation of people, what is she, which word does she constantly use? What was her hobby? What was the role she did before this? And through that, you essentially, as they're taking down notes, they're learning things. Then we ask questions. What was the critical event she needed to buy? What was the impact? Our celebration of a deal has now become the next person's learning moment. By doing this, what do you think the person will do when he or she then wins a deal by herself? What is gonna happen? He or she knows what the questionnaire is because they just filled it out. And what they start to prepare is they start to learn in that moment, oh, I have to go on later on because I'm gonna win this deal. I need to know the answer to these questions. And so what are they going to do during the call? During the call they're on, they're now gonna focus. As they look up a person, they now know what to look up on LinkedIn. This is the use of a customer-centric approach to primarily just the winning and return just a single event, the announcement of the deal, into a great customer-centric experience. And that is the key of winning by design's methodology. How can we make little changes that have a big impact? So too, so did I ask from you. Next time, when you hit that gong, when you celebrate, pop up that phone and record that.